Welcome to today's little episode of Bit News. Let's see what we have. Uh, oh, ATMs. We all want Bitcoin ATMs. There are now 285 of them around the world. That may not sound like much, but it's growing. Settle down back there. The first Bitcoin ATM was only la launched about a year ago, and today there are hundreds of them. That means that if you want to send cash from, say, Portland to Bangkok or from Montreal to Mexico City, you don't have to rely on Western Union anymore. What you do is you just convert your dollars to Bitcoins at an ATM, and then you send the Bitcoins to the recipient who redeems the Bitcoins for cash in their city. It's, it's fast. They clear in less than an hour. It is a little more expensive than Western Union right now. You'll pay fees of 3 to 5%, but the more ATMs they get, the more the price will come down. At least that's what they are. That's what they tell me. So it's interesting stuff. And, and another ATM story, actually. It's ATM day today. Uh, last night, a Spanish hotel chain that accepts payment in Bitcoin celebrated the launch of a Bitcoin ATM in one of its hotels, right there in the hotel. Enrique de Solis Teo. Did I get that right? Is that okay? On, I'm going to say it again. Enrique de Solis Teo partner at One Shot Hotel said the ATM has processed more than $5,000 in transactions since it was installed. New hotels owned by the same company are set to open in Barcelona, Seville, Valencia. I've been to Valencia. I spent two weeks there once. Barcelona, Seville, Valencia, and London next year. One of my favorite cities in the world. And London next year. And they will all accept payment in Bitcoin. How about that? 